Hey, it's Cool Year if you don't know, and it is time for some more of Paper Mario The Thousand Year Door, and I have uh, with me uh, uh, the guest who requested this game. Hello, that's me. <laughs> that's you, that's Zuzio. It's -a me, Zuzio. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't say anything. I don't know why my um, Google Assistant decided to start listening there. I just really wants to be helpful. Indeed. <laughs> oh, uh, I don't know if I remember to turn on the... I think I did, but I don't remember if I remember... I don't remember if I remembered to turn on the uh, game changer. Oh, that might be helpful. Oh no, it is on. In fact, I forgot to turn my uh, my reward redeems off for the race. So, like, I I basically uh, for for those watching on YouTube, I was in the Times Winner Randomizer Tournament, and uh, I basically booked my match today to play today. So, it was a <laughs> bit of a rush. It ended up working out, though. It did. Okay. So, last time, we started doing Chapter 2. Uh, and we are stuck with uh, these 101 punies, which I don't remember where they are. But I can just talk to Yellow here and... <laughs> awesome views. Yeah, they got trapped somewhere. Okay, I need to... I need to stop picking the first option. Where are my punies? Well, my calling them is, isn't is going... Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, they got trapped. Yeah. You know what? I love you. <laughs> Oh my. Oh wow. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I don't doubt it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Punderton? Punderton. That, that sure is a name. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Good. I'm glad we got that covered. Yeah, yeah. That was very important. <laughs> The important lore. <laughs> okay, um... Right, we got this. I don't remember in which direction I need to go, though. Yeah, I couldn't tell you. <laughs> um... I think now that we have the boots, I need to go back to where... The punies got trapped, right? Sounds right. Okay, where? Sorry, I am super disoriented. You're good. Probably part of it is is that uh, time's been race. <laughs> Yeah, assume the adrenaline uh, coming down is, uh, <laughs> you know, not helpful. <laughs> yeah, no, I I wasn't expecting to do two streams today. Yeah. <laughs> Probably still can't get up there. Yeah. So tantalizing. I know, right? Still blocked. Oh, okay. Dead end. 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 <laughs> also, still can't get that. What? Well, the enemies didn't 
enemies didn't respawn, which was nice. Yeah, I would have expected them to respawn after reloading. Yeah, same. Now we can break these. Hey. Now I can go into this fight. Where will it take us? Yeah, hey, multi bounce is a lot better now. <laughs> What's that? Multi bounce is a lot better now. <laughs> yeah, uh, that's, that was one of the effects of uh, getting the the new stompy boots. Yep. Because it does increase my jump power. I am gonna need to switch to Jimbo for this one, right? Or for the one. Gotta check all the bushes. Remember to do all your checks. <laughs> or in some cases, n not really bother with a, with a certain check and it works out anyway. And <laughs> then I got attacked. Flowers. Dang. Dang. And that's why it sucks to have multiple of those, uh, yeah. X dudes. The X dudes. Getting pretty good at uh, super guarding. You are. Okay, now you're wrong. How dare you attack first? Oh. <laughs> Increase your star points, we get 12. We're almost there. <laughs> we have 25 HP, 10 FP, and I think 9 BP. That sounds right. Yep. Yeah. I think we have enough HP for like <laughs> half the <a> game. <laughs> yeah, probably have enough for a while. Yeah. I'm guessing this water is still filled with bronze. Yeah. Yeah. Shine spread over there. Hmm. What is up with these? Oh, I remember what's up with these. We can't do anything with that yet. Hmm. But if I go here. Ah. Uh -huh. Pound this button. Boom. Bam. Wait. Ah. Uh -huh. I see. Okay. All right. Um. There we go. Ooh, 
Ooh. Ah. Hello. <laughs> Hello. It is a jump power. I don't remember ever using that one. I already don't remember what it is. <laughs> My memory is frazzled and fragmented at the best of times. Understandable. Have a nice day. <laughs> well, I may have made an error in judgment. <laughs> I mean, I was gonna have to do that anyway, but um... Hmm. Uh, no, it's just going back down to the bottom part, yeah. Yep. Okay, well. Alright. I saw it. Uh -huh. Oh. Oh, man. <laughs> yeah, you can get out of here and then you proceed to not. Okay. Come on, everyone. <laughs> Go ahead and put this thing here. And we're going to switch to Madame Flurry. completely miss the thing that I'm trying to do. <laughs> the PNAs are being difficult. Come on, guys. There we go. <laughs> really? Get in the hole! <laughs> Why are you like this? Just tap it in. Tap a tap a tap a. <laughs> there it goes. <laughs> okay, you're all here, right? Nope. Oh my goodness. And this is why this dungeon sucks. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Come on, everyone. Okay, I think they all joined. We'll see. <laughs> hey. <laughs> okay. I gotta do this again. <sighs> Come on. <laughs> Guys. Guys, guys, please. <laughs> My dudes. Dudes, dudettes, whatever <laughs> else you want to get called. Them bows. You know. <laughs> Make sure not to, not to forget that. It's an interesting concept, but yeah. uh, the execution is less Anime. than idea. Yes. <laughs> um, yeah, go down. Everyone still with me? <laughs> you better be. Or else. <laughs> okay. 
Y'all stand on the thing. <laughs> uh, what's... Oh no, what's happening? It's an elevator. So that's how you get to this room. Oh. I just oh. walked into the boss room without saving. This is great. Oh no. <laughs> you got this? <laughs> hmm. Let's see. This thing's gotta be around here somewhere. Uh huh? What's that? Oh, sounds like a mob. Clear, clear out. Oh, maybe it's not the boss yet. Okay, I can backtrack. Good. Yay. This for the measure. I flip, think flip, even, flip. even if there was a loose tile in this room, I don't think I'd be able to flip it with all of these goonies. And I hope that there is a way to uh, to easily find these loose tiles later in the game. <laughs> yeah. Let's see. I thought I saw something there. I guess not. Hmm. Oh my. Oh. Things are happening. It's the Crystal Star! Ah, that was easy. <laughs> is, it, is this gonna be like in uh, Super Mario RPG where they give you one for free but they make you fight for one twice? Hmm, maybe. Hmm. Guess we'll find out. Oh dear me! Mario! Isn't that the Crystal Star? Oh. Well... Oh dear, that wretched beast again! Dear me! <laughs> Man, am I lucky or what? Or am I just good? Oh, you say you need to click that crystal star, Lord Crumb? Boom! Falls right into my lap! Still, this is humiliating. You shouldn't have been able to, to escape that cell. So, for insulting my awesome trap, I'm gonna repay you with a little present. You know what it is? Probably a boss. Yeah, just a little something I like to call a remote time bomb detonator. Or that. That also works, yeah. I'm gonna use this to bury you and those squirmy punies in rubble. Sound fun? We'll enjoy your final minutes inside this dank old tree. And with that, pow, I'm gone. I am going to speed through this a little bit because um, time is continuously running no matter what you're doing. Even while it's loading in. That is level club nice. That's not the right one. <laughs> Koops is the one I want. We need uh, the Koops. By the way, since we are in a hurry, HP, FP, or BP? Uh, BP, 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 BP. And time still keeps going while you're leveling up! Who thought of this? Gosh, yeah. <laughs> I would normally pull the chat, but I think it's just you and me right now, plus time is running. Yes, time is of the essence. Um, <laughs> Can you hit that? Yeah. Okay. Nice. Hopefully you don't need the PAs for anything. <laughs> I don't think you do. And the, all of these areas, I'm pretty sure, are going to be available later on if I need to come back. Yeah.
You won't be going any farther this way. Alright, I'm hurrying. <laughs> Sorry I'm skipping all of this, but like I said, time is running no matter what's happening on the screen. <laughs> Until now. Okay, you piss! One pummeling coming up with extra fist. Metal fist, that is. Magnus Von Grapple, time for a technological thrashing. Enjoy! Oh, that's fancy. Are you crying yet? Yeah? Sorry, but this thing ain't, isn't armed with tissues. Well, Magnus Von Grapple has that effect on people. Total weeping terror. And you ain't seen nothing yet. Check out the power on this bad boy. Yikes, that thing is strong. But I can't shake the feeling that there's something just not right about him. Be alert, okay? We can't let ourselves get careless. Okay, let's start by... Good old tattle. That's Magnus Von Grapple. It's a giant robot built by the x -Nots. Lord Crump drives it. Max HP is 30, attack is 2, and defense is 1. Its most effective attack is one that takes an advantage of its size, a smothering stomp. It can also shoot out its fists, which do these super gnarly rocket punches. His fists ha have max HP of 2, an attack of 4, and defense of 0. His fists are super powerful, so it's best to knock him down fast. The thing about this robot is I can't tell if it looks cool or really, really stupid. <laughs> smashy, smashy. Smashy. Here comes, suckers! Magnus Von Punish! Okay, that was hard to time. Like yeah. that that would have been hard to time for a regular guard. Uh switch to Flory, she has more HP. Yell Force ain't gonna work on this one. <laughs> it's a little bit hard to blow away. Uh oh it's I was, I was wondering, it sounded like something fell there, but I think it was just some uh, small decoration. Probably. Well, that was, a, that was a little more painful. Oh, come on, man. I'm not really sure how you're supposed to properly guard that. <laughs> Keep on power smashing. I'll just have a banger though. There we go. Full stylish. God <laughs> dang it, really? Oh, it ain't over yet. This is so awesome. Check out what check out what else this guy can do. You're gonna love it. This may not work out too well for you. Especially since they're floating. <laughs> but they also have no defense, so yeah. one body slam. I'll take out the first one. Yeah. Oh, well that helps. <laughs> oh, it's electrified! Oh no. Mm. Uh, can you hammer it from there? No, it's floating. Mm -hmm. Unfortunate. I can't power block. Oh boy. Um, this really sucks. Mm. Well, not much not much else we can do. Uh, 
nice. <laughs> oh. Oh, well. <laughs> All right. That works. <laughs> if you're going to help us out, game, that's fine. Yeah, yeah. I didn't, I didn't even see what hit me there. I think it was like a quake attack or something. One more power smash. Completely miss the stylish. Oh well. <laughs> right, here they come again. Hmm. Wondering what I want my move to be here. I think what I'm gonna do is use a honey syrup. I was going to do sweet treat, but not if the fists are out. The flurries special move take care of the fist. I don't know. I could have tried. Well, I actually I couldn't have tried that because I was out of FP. Well, Mario could have used the, the I mean, syrup. It's... Yeah. I'm just curious. That works too, of course. But yeah, I'm kind of curious. <laughs> Yeah, I honestly don't see what hit me. Um, okay, so what do I yeah. want to do? I want to do Sweet Dream. Pretty good haul. Yeah. <laughs> okay, let's see if I can block this this time. Nope. <laughs> Timing for that is kind of super wonky. Good. Can't last. Get break. I like how the entire thing just gets squashed. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Uh oh. And actually, I'm going to give Coops the glory here. Ah. Yeah, I know, but that. Really? I thought that was going to finish him. Oh, uh, the one defense. Well, that backfired, but oh, no. <laughs> at the very least, it's done. Yeah, <sighs> this could be the end. 30 star points. Decent, decent. Yep. No! Magnus Von Grapple! How can we lose? I'll remember this, losers! Think you're the loser. But you <laughs> lost that fight. Yeah, you literally lost. Lord Crump summons us! Retreat, heads up, run away, wake up! Oof! Pull it off, Mario! I can't believe it! Wow! They're gone! The place, this place can go back to being the peaceful place I remember. Alright there, Martio. You can have the Emerald Star, the Crystal Star that resided in this tree. Boom! You got a Crystal Star! Yay! 
And you'll learn the special move, Clock Out. End of chapter! Good work. Yeah. And so, after pummeling Lord Crump, Mario obtained the second Crystal Star. With the Exnos gone, peace once again prevailed throughout the Great Tree. The Boggly Woods echoed with the puny songs of joy. But this may not be the last our hero hears from the vile Exnos. They will surely continue to stand in Mario's way and try to put a stop to his efforts. And we're probably going to be back to the Great Tree, because there's doubtless some stuff that I missed in there. But first, let's go check up on Bowser. Or, no, Princess, then Bowser, sorry. Yep. <laughs> what? Say that again. You can't get in touch with Lord Crump. You're correct, sir. We're investigating now. We should hear any time. Sir Gordis, please allow me to enter. Yes, what is it? I have a report, sir. The crystal star in the Boggly Woods has apparently been taken by Mario. What? You must be joking. What about Lord Crump and the Shadow Sirens? Uh, I'm sorry, sir. Unfortunately, Mario laid a beating on all of them. Hmm. Disturbing. This Mario character, what kind of... Speak up, Exnot. What is the status of the other Crystal Stars? I apologize, sir. We're still searching for the other Crystal Stars. Unsuccessfully, sir. I know of three of them. Oaktail Castle, Bogley Woods, the one we got in Rollport. That means there are four crystal stars left out there. And we will have them. Keep looking so that Mario won't beat us to the punch. Yes, sir! As I suspected, there's no, there's no reason to doubt that Mario has that map. He must. Listen up! You. I want you to keep a close watch on what Mario does from now on. Absolutely, sir. Mario, I love you. Intense. <laughs> oh, Mario. Did you even read the mail I sent you? I wonder. I wonder so many things. I wonder how everyone is doing at the castle. Will they never dance at the Mushroom Ball again? What will become of me? Well... Oh, I guess we're just moving straight forward. <laughs> oh, is this text doing again? So we don't need to take another shower and get, uh... Tech all heated up. <laughs> Overclock the <laughs> CPU, if you know what I mean. <laughs> Hello, Princess Peach. I am glad you came. That mail I sent to Mario, did it reach him already? Right? Yes, I can confirm that Mario received the mail. Is that so? Oh, well, good. So what do you want from me today? Is there more t is there more you want to know of love? You expressed regret early that you would not be able to dance at a ball, correct? Excuse me? Were you eavesdropping? I am sorry, Princess Peach. I have been ordered to keep surveillance on you. But it is odd. When you said that, I had an impulse to dance with you as well. How my CPU would produce the symbols is inexplicable. I must find what caused it. I know what caused it? There's no reason behind such a feeling, Tech. Wanting to do something together, it's part of love. I know it. But then again, you are, well, a computer. Princess Peach, please dance with me. Wait, wait just a minute. 
We'll take a drink here. <laughs> Stay hydrated. These, uh, these high-pitched voices are a little hard. <laughs> what am I supposed to do? You say you want to dance? It's just so bizarre. Oh, it about to get a whole lot more bizarre. Just wait. Yeah. I mean, how in the world can I dance with you? I have no arms, or feet, or moves. Would this be an acceptable dance substitute? Oh my goodness, is that me? Did you create that? Oh, alright I guess. I must say though, it's going to feel weird dancing with myself. Press the button as they display on the screen. I'm probably going to mess this up because I'm pressing different buttons than what are displayed on the screen. Oh, that's hard. <laughs> I'm basically going, like, I map the buttons based on um, approximately how they would be um, uh, No. No. Oh, no. Oh, no. I am... Oh, jeez. Oh, no. Hey. There. Ah. <laughs> that was poor. Princess Speech. I still do not understand very well. Will you please dance it? Really? Oof. Okay. Actually flubbed the input there and I still got it. Nice. <laughs> okay, hopefully that's good enough. Hopefully. Thank you, Princess Peach. That was very fun. Just a moment. Fun? Is this impulse I feel the concept known as fun? Tech? Are you okay? Princess Peach. I will fulfill my promise to you. Please use my community. Use the keyboard to send whatever message you want. I'm finished, Tech. Could you send it? The message has been sent. Please go back to your room. I want to analyze the data from the stats in me. The, da the data that I thought was fun. You are a weird computer. No, you are mistaken. I am the world's best and only perfect computer. Good night, Princess Peach. I mean, you can be perfect and still weird. Now yeah, this big boy. It's our boy. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty sure it's just is just up ahead here. Right as usual, Lord Bowser. We just got word that Princess Peach was spotted in the town up ahead. Good. Yes, very good. But I'm off. These fools don't know what's coming. <laughs> My lord, you're so super. Oh jeez, I forgot this was a thing in this game. Yep. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Rude. 
very rude. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> that's so silly. <laughs> there we go. Hey. That's that's how you, that's how you win a level, right? You knock down the entire flagpole. Yeah, that makes sense. <laughs> oh hey, welcome to Pelipper again. Ah! Hide everybody, hide! What a mess. Yes, hi, chickens! I have no need for any of you. What I do need, though, is Princess Peach. Now where is she? Tell me this instant. Uh, Bowser, over there! Bingo! Princess Peach! Man, that was easy. I found you, my princess. I... Bowser, the mighty Koopa King, offer my greeting. <laughs> now, now, know that silent treatment. You're coming to my castle with me. <laughs> Clearly, she's so, she's so overcome with joy that she's been left speechless. Uh huh. The mind of a maiden is, well, rather complicated. <laughs> <laughs> I see, I see. How refined, how elegant, awesome. I suppose I could live with a silent princess. It might even have its perks, you know. No! My, my life's treasure. I'd rather die than give up my life-size peach poster. Um. <laughs> Why was that over a window? That, that is odd. <laughs> the poster? Oh my goodness me, didn't see that coming. Great, just great. Now I look like the huge mighty king of guys who talk to posters! <laughs> ah, I love great. the Bowser sequences. Very important plot developments there. <laughs> also, do you like my Rita Repulsa impression? <laughs> <laughs> it's lovely. <laughs> or should I say repulsive? <laughs> <laughs> uh, thank you, Mario, for everything you've done. We can go back to our peaceful way of life now. You know, son, now that we get down to it, I'm kind of sad to see you go. I do love pontificating, so come on by whenever you want to sit and chat a while. Yes, please come back and visit. We'll watch for you. We'll work together from now on to prevent anything like that from happening again. Thanks for showing us how to stick together, Mario. Good luck with the Crystal Stars. We'll come back and see you again, I'm pretty sure. But for now, we gotta go. See you, Mr. Mario. Oh. Uh did you, in the room with the shine spray that we didn't get, did you try flurry on the big pot thing on the air, airplane pad? Uh, no. I think that might be it. That might be it, but, uh, I mean, the fact is we're probably gonna be back in there at some point, so... That's fair, that's fair. No! Oh man, incoming meal! Dear Mario, I'm sure you're very concerned about me, but please know I'm fine. I'm actually more worried about you. The fiends who kidnapped me are searching desperately for the Crystal Stars. I'll try to learn what I can about them. I'll email again if I uncover anything, okay? You must know I miss you. Lately I've dreamt about our days back in the castle. I hope we'll spend carefree days there again soon. Princess Peach. Hey, nice, huh, Mario? It's weird that she would, like, specifically point out the carefree days of the castle. I, as, as though, like, her getting kidnapped doesn't happen, like, once <laughs> a year. Yeah. Ow. Ow. Oh, 
Oh no. Um, I am actually going to flood this. Just, uh... Mostly to make sure that I don't, uh, spin the wheels there. Yeah. <laughs> oh, really? Wow. <laughs> And I have lost some audience out of that. And let me tell you, I know a lot of things about not having an audience. Oof. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Sneak attacks now. <laughs> nice. I'm not sure if that was gonna work out though. Oh wait, yeah. Oh no. <laughs> mm. That's kind of dumb. It's like I clearly jumped on its head and it yeah. still is pointed upward. Yeah, that's kind of a not very nice. Well, I say on its head, but like, on a place where there are no spikies. Yeah. I'm going to put Mario in the back at this point. <laughs> really? I have to do power, uh, power slam? I deserve two defense. It must. Not sure how close I need to be to a loose panel for it to pop up. Hmm. But I'm pretty sure there are no loose panels underneath the flowers, so. Yeah, yeah. So let's go ahead and visit the Thousand Year Door. Yeah. And find out where we're going next. Hmm. Can I get that? I sure can. Hey. Damage dodge. Increase damage by one with a guard action command. Of course, considering that I use super guard, um, probably don't need that. Yeah, fair. <laughs> Okay, so I need to... Oh. Oh, that's suspicious. It's suspicious in a way that we can now deal with. Hey. Uh, Treasure! Treasure! Happy heart partner! Slowly and automatically restore HP and battle. Neat. Because right now we're still a bit strapped for uh, for badge points, so... Uh... Mm -hmm. Yeah, kind of tempted to just get more BP and next level up, but FP would probably be good too, I don't know. <laughs> Actually, can... didn't we get BP in the last... yeah, we did. Yeah, we and, did, yeah. And then I didn't do anything about it because we were on a timer. Yes, <laughs> kind of in a hurry. <laughs> um... So many options. Yeah. Okay, so... Also, let me... Store these. 
So happy heart for both is two. I think I might go for happy heart partner because the partner will usually have less health. Yeah, that makes sense. And um, let's go close call, I guess. Yeah. So many Seems options. Right. Mario, please wake up. <laughs> okay. Now, my little Mario, it's Crystal Star time. <laughs> Star number two. And let's take a look at where we're going next. Of course, next, after we reveal this, I'm probably going to be doing the um, Chapter 2 Troubles. Makes but sense. then we are going to be going up in the sky. Oh. Interesting. The location of a crystal star uh, has been recorded on your magical map. Oh, mercy me! The next crystal star has made an entrance, my, my, my. But, correct me if I'm wrong, but... Isn't it up in the sky? What does that mean? Hmm. That means that beneath this town, the thousand-year-old uh, ruin. That means that beneath this town, the thousand-year-old ruins remain intact. And that door has been sealed uh, sealed shut for a thousand years by the crystal stars. In order to open that seal, we must uh, we have to muster the power of all the crystal stars. Perhaps I'm just daft, but why would they seal? Why would they want to seal this treasure away at all? Did they fear thieves and brigands? If not, then what? No, that's not. Hmm, that's not what. I don't know. <laughs> Frankly, please. I'm sorry, so sorry. I know that the treasure was sealed away around the time the town was destroyed. But the problem is, no one's even sure what it was that caused the town's demise. All that's written is this. Darkness stole the sky, and the, cat the cataclysm rained down. I must research this more. Assuming this will uh, assuming will just make an well, you know the same. Oh yes, how inappropriate. In any case, what about the location of the of this crystal star that's floating on the map? Hmm, very interesting. Perhaps it's pointing to the floating town of Glitzville. There's a stunning arena uh, there where great warriors engage in furious battles. Ostensibly, families go there on vacation to lounge and enjoy the fights, but behind the scenes, the richest people in the world wager on the bouts. A floating city, you say? So are we just supposed to sprout wings and fly there, darling? Do tell. A special glimpse lies there. It departs from Roadport several times a day. The problem is getting a seat. The only way to get a ticket is through certain channels. Ooh, that sounds exciting. A little on the seedy side. Show me the way. I don't know, but I guess we don't have much choice. Word on the street is, all tickets go through Don Pianta on the west side. Head west from Roeport's main plaza, then you'll reach, you'll reach the west side of town. That part of town is under the control of Don Pianta, the Pianta Syndicate head. Apparently, Don Pianta makes pretty regular jaunts over to Glitzville. Mmm, I like the sound of this Don Pianta fellow. I cannot wait to meet him. It may sound easy, but he's a Syndicate boss, folks. The, ru the rumors about him are scary. 
and Don Pianta is reckless. Just getting an audience with him will be difficult. Well, oh, get started. <laughs> exactly. By the way, any uh, tattles that become inaccessible will show up in this bin. So if I happen to not tattle a boss, we haven't lost out. Oh, actually didn't know that. <laughs> well, now you know. Now I know. <laughs> uh, so let's see, we got an email. Oh jeez. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Not this guy. Okay. Uh, nice hiding look at Goonstar Temple. Have we been there? Have we? It's so cold my shell is frosty. I don't know. We, I don't know that we have access to that. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, with all of that out of the way, hello, Lord Tyrion. Yeah, hi, Tyrion. <laughs> Sorry, it took a while to get to you. Okay, so um, we have some troubles to deal with, and it's not in that way. We only have three, fortunately. A life shroom. Hmm. Well, it's unfortunate that uh, that uh, she's asking for a life shroom, but fortunately, we have one. Well, that's good. Now I just have to remember how we get down there. <laughs> Actually, let me go and save. But that's a lot of stuff we've done. Yeah, that was a lot of text. <laughs> uh, was it this one? Yes. I'm not sure how that counted as a preemptive attack, but sure. Here, I'll take it. <laughs> There's also a thing that I just remembered I forgot to do, and I was about to do it, but then I got that email. Ah. Uh. Oh. We'll, we'll be back in town soon. Mm-hmm. <laughs> A single star point. I'm feeling a bit tired, so I might hop off voice, but I might join rejoin in the Twitch chat a little bit later. Alright, no worries. Alright. Thanks for having me. Thanks for dropping by and uh see you in chat if you're up for that. Yeah, see ya. You know what? That's the wrong way. Okay, can't break that with that. This is where we need to go. I do not understand how web browsers are so memory hungry. Like I'm I'm looking at my RAM cons consumption right now and my web browser is taking up uh 2.8 gigabytes. Which is kind of absurd. Actually, yeah, you are not able to do anything. Uh, 
how many tabs open, I would have to check. But the fact is, like, a lot of those tabs are uh, hibernated, so they're not even loaded. Pontificate. Here's your life room. You can at least get my name right. Well, we got 60 coins out of that. That's not bad. Playing Vampire Survivors didn't make you recognize the Paper Mario music. Didn't let you. Oh good. Dizzy. Awesome. I'm so dizzy my head's spinning. Like the whirlpool in my ends. Oh jeez, I am actually out of... Okay, well I'll tell you one thing that can't miss. That's a pretty good haul. Um, I don't think you're gonna be able to do anything, so. And then I finished the fight with. with a super guard. Because of course I did. You know what? Never mind those coins, let's just run. Run, 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 run. I kind of wish that, like, you had an option to, like, use the, um, the star map to, um, get transported back to the Thousand Year Door. Just, like, a free warp back to town, you know? Also, I'm sure... I see that dude there at the top left. What's their deal? Anyway, the thing that I was going to do is this. Welcome to the home of Merlin, the super magician. Okay, so uh, let me go ahead and put up a poll.
I'm not gonna put it up for too long. I'm gonna put it up for one minute. And I'm handing out two power-ups, because each one has three Shine Sprites. So who's not getting one this round? Looks like we got one vote for Goombella. People can hang out in their roofs if they want to. I mean, I guess. What if it's not their roof, though? I think it's safe to say it's going to be Goombella. Chizumi! Chizumi! Time to power up Flurry. Chazumi! Chazumi! Then you may go. Sorry, Goombella, but we'll get you ranked up um, soon enough. Okay. So what, we, we literally just need to go talk to this Lala, and that's it. I'll come back to you. The boss told me you uh, told uh, the boss told me to look after this place. If you if you do anything funny. I'll toss you like that. That was a very bad impression of such a person. Yes, I did. I mean, I guess it's something. That, that was literally, like, no trouble at all. By the way, since we're here, oh, yeah, there is a reason that I came down here. Bear with me. Also, I completely forgot to uh, to stylish there. Not sure that this has been necessary, but uh, it's happening. We probably only have a couple of uh, events left for that. Uh, the game will tell us when uh, 
we're out of events. Now is it over here I want it to come now? Actually, you jump on that one. Yeah. And this is why I came now. It's literally just another way to get to this room. Games are really pushing us to go in there. But I say, not yet. One more trouble. Okay. So where is... You know what I said about the game really pushing me to go down there? We're going down there. It's gotta be nice when I can break that block. Not that hard of a jump. In fact, Madame Flory is taking advantage of the fact that she's a boo. I'm not really going to be able to make the proper toad voice, but you know what they sound like. You took out my trouble? Just terrible. 
my dad went into the pit of a hundred trials and he never came out. He lost his job and said the only one to support us was of his treasure. But I don't need treasure. I just want my dad back. Please help him. Ladies and gentlemen, and also everyone else, welcome to the pit of a hundred trials. Uh, let me go ahead and switch to Goombella. So you might ask, what is the Pit of 100 Trials? It is literally a dungeon that has 100 floors in it. That's a Gloomba. It likes damp, uh, dark damp places. Max HP is 7, attack is 3, and defense is 0. It's stronger than a normal Goomba, so be careful. It's not a healthy color for a Goomba, but it doesn't mean it's sick or anything. So don't show any mercy. Okie dokie. So, as can be expected, each floor gets harder and harder. Um, and you're pretty much stuck going down unless there's a, an exit pipe back up. Oh, jeez. Five of them? Well, fortunately, just so happens that we've upgraded Coops, and so his power shell will take out all five. I have actually done a pit of 100 trials, and I can guarantee you right now we're not finishing it uh, today. Um, I am going as far as is required to complete the trouble. And that's it. Now I say that I've done it. It's been a very long time, so I don't remember how worth it the prize is. Also, hey, Ricky. I think that there is a badge that makes it so that any trivial fights, if you manage to attack first, uh, you skip the fight. I, I don't remember for sure, but I, it's, I seem to recall there's something like that. And that makes like starting this place a lot easier. Because you just kind of blow through it until you get to a point where, you know, things are more your level.
Dang. I'm just gonna keep. Oh, dang it! I just, I, I just, I'm just gonna keep doing this, and if you get hit by it, it's your own fault. And then I got hit. Talk shit, get hit, I guess. Dang. To level 10, we will have solved the, um, the trouble. I know a few things about getting through this stuff. For a few coins, I can move you where you want to go. Where do you want to go? A sleepy stomp executes superbly to make enemies sleepy. So now we can return to the entrance. But it seems like we're gonna have to keep going in order to find that uh, vagrant uh, mushroom person. And switch to Goombella so we can get a tattle. Make sure to hit with hammer so that this guy doesn't lose his weight. Eric Limba, it's a blue mill with wings. Max HP is 7, attack is 3, and defense is 0. It's like a stronger version of a Paracoupa, and maybe that's all there is to it. I wonder if living down here may ever makes his wings moldy. Mm, yuck! It's too gross to even think about. Blech. Man, the timing on that is tricky. Anyway, Pokey. That's a Pokey. It's a cactus school that's got nasty spines all over his body. Max HP is 4, attack is 3, and defense is 0. Look at all those spines. Those would totally hurt. If you stomp on it, you'll regret it. Pokies attack by lobbing, by lobbing parts of their bodies and by charging you. They can even call friends in for help, so be quick about taking them out. Trying to time it there, but it didn't really work out. 
Uh, let's go ahead and switch to Kooks. I think using Hammer is, uh, is uh, yeah. Mario is safe with him. Haha! Right back at you, buddy. It's cool, but I wouldn't do the whole thing for it. Fair enough. I'm probably still gonna do the whole thing. I mean, not today, but at some point. This is not going to be an edge. It's dumb that you can like execute perfectly and still lose uh, audience. Body slam. Oh, well, we're in the realm of two star points now. <laughs> but things are getting a little trickier. Still no sign of that uh of that toad. Awful nice if you were to give me that uh, fire flower. Nope. Ah, oh, where is that toad? Get down here. Dude. Really? Is that as low as you go? Okay, we're well, fine. I still struck first somehow. However, I missed my timing. Dang. Oh, really? Okay, fine. And watch this miss. No? Okay. In that case, I think you're done. Yep. Well, 
Level 15. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Somehow that was a first attack, okay. I'm guessing this is probably the last one. And we're gonna need to recharge after this. No? Man, that, uh, that third option that we got is, uh, very economical. I think what I'm gonna do is real quick switch to coops. And dang! I'll tell you exactly what happened there. That was analog stick bounce. Uh-oh. Oh, we're not doing well. We're not doing well at all. A couple of health back. Mm. You know what? We only have all fresh rooms. Oh, we have the scoop of tea. I'll use that. That restores FP. Yeah, silly. Billy. There he is. Fine, we can just do our shell. That one's hard to block. Yeah, Coop's being the hero in the half shell here. Also, making sure that I do not go into the pipe before I talk to this guy. Huh? What? Who are you? Wow, did you come here to just, just to save me? Really? Pine Tea Jr.? Wow. Good. I have to get out I have to get back alive. Show me the way out. The 
now I just gotta make it to 420. I'm gonna absolutely rush there. Flurry. Fan of that. That's fine. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Can you imagine if I had run out of uh, HP with that hit? Anyway, we've leveled up. Well, what are we going to level up? So we currently have uh, 25 HP, we have 10 FP and 12 BP. So the last level we did BP. Which I actually didn't pull the audience because of that, uh, that friggin' countdown timer. Been running into a lot of FP deficits, honestly. But at the same time, we have the FP plus badge, which costs 3 BP. Um, and we'd be able to switch it out with something else if we don't run into those problems anymore. However, FP won the board, so we'll, we'll go with that. Don't need this hard anymore. And here we are at floor 20. Hey! Exit! Okay, Pine Tea Jr., I'm on my way home. Fire Drive! Attack all ground enemies and burn them as well. Believe in not using BP to get extra FP. Fair enough. Anyway, we've solved the trouble. My dad's back! Sorry for troubling you. I guess health and family really are the most important things. And now, I'll look for new work. I've got to be strong for my dear son. Thank you so, so much. I'll give you my treasure as a reward. It's really important to me, but nothing's more important than my dad. So here. Silver card. Now if you'll excuse us, and really thank you so very much. And that is all of the troubles for chapter two. There are only three of them. So with that, as we stand before the Thousand Year Door, it has instructed us to go up or climb, one might say, to ascend. But where are we ascending to, and how will we get there? Um, that's going to involve a visit to Don Pianta, and we will take care of that after the break. Also, I forgot to uh, turn this off. Where's Cat talking? There we go. So, um, you know, I can take a moment, get some water, go to the, bath the bathroom if you need to, stretch your arms, stretch your legs, stretch your teeth, and um, in about 10-15 minutes we will uh, go ahead and, um, Mario's sleeping, 
we'll go ahead and uh, visit Don Pianta and see what we can do about getting on that blimp to the Glitz bit. So, I'll see you in a bit.